shopping around for your mortgage, here's the inside scoop on how to do it right. The largest financial transaction of your life is far too important to place into the hands of someone who is not capable of advising you properly. Here are four simple questions you need to ask your lender to make sure he or she is experienced enough to guide you through the loan process. Number one, what are most interest rates based on? The only correct answer is mortgage-backed securities or mortgage bonds, not the Fed or the 10-year treasury note. While the 10-year treasury note sometimes trends in the same direction as mortgage bonds, it is not unusual to see them move in completely opposite direction. Do not work with a lender who has their eyes on the wrong indicators. Number two, what is the next economic report or event that could cause interest rates to move? A professional lender will have this at their fingertips. Contact me to receive an up-to-date calendar of economic reports and events that may cause rates to fluctuate. Number three, when the Fed changes rates, what does this mean? And what impact does this have on mortgage interest rates? The answer may actually surprise you. When the Fed makes a move, they're changing a very short-term rate that impacts credit cards and lines of credit, but not fixed mortgage rates. For details, see my article on how the Fed impacts mortgage rates. Number four, what is happening in the market today and what do you see in the near future? If a lender cannot show you and explain you a picture of what's happening with mortgage bonds and interest rates, you're probably talking with someone who is not experienced enough to handle one of the largest and most important financial transactions you will ever make. You might do this only four or five times in your entire life, but I do this every single day. Therefore, contact me for more details or schedule an initial conversation with us.